All right, so this first item that I'm showing you here is uh, kind of a silly little thing. This is part of the estate sale buy that uh, we just did. And it is a bottle opener, but it is an anatomically correct bottle opener. I'm not going to zoom in on it here, but it is a male, <laughs> and it is anatomically correct. And what a, What's that word, anatomically? Anywho. Yeah, it, you can tell it's a boy. So you don't want to be, uh, I don't want to, you want to see? You can't really tell. Can you tell? You can't tell. Anywho, uh, we're going to put this up there. My wife said, maybe we shouldn't put that up there. And I said, you know what? I'm going to put it up there. It's 20 bucks right there. Look, 20 bucks. So minimum is what I'm thinking. Because there's a bunch of different ones very, very similar to this up there. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and get a couple different angles of it zoom in on it like that we'll bust out the ruler so i keep a ruler on hand i keep a measurement a uh, taylor's measurement tape measurement measuring tape on hand i keep a yardstick you never know what you're going to need so you keep a few different things on hand and then uh, i like to include pictures with some kind of a ruler, some kind of a measuring device in there. Um, so people have an idea of the scale of what it, they're looking at buying. I do see a maker's mark really close down here. So I'm going to see if I can zoom in on that. Um, it doesn't really show. It's just like a hole. So that will be the best I can do on that. And then uh, I like to keep a scale nearby. This was the scale I started out with. It weighs up to 11 pounds. So I keep that off here to the side. Then I can uh, set it right here. Oops, put my item on there. Take a picture of it. So when I go back to do my listing, I know exactly how much this item weighs and the measurements of it. Um, and so that goes back to when you ship your item. Every every step that you take when you're creating your listing or when you're, yeah, every step that you take when you picture your listing, that's going to make the next step that much easier if you have their measurements because you don't have to guess. You don't have to guess how much this weighs. That'd be hard to guess. Well, by putting on the scale and taking a picture of it, when you go to sit down and list those, unless you list instantly, some people list right away. I don't. I like to take a batch of, you know, 10, 15, 20, 25 pictures uh, or of pictures of 25 different items. Then I'll sit down and I'll go through and knock them all out. That's how I like to do it. Everyone has their own way to do it. Why don't you go ahead and leave it in the comments below. How do you do it? Do you do everything in batches or do you do you list as you go? Do you list as you go? All right. So, that was this first item. Want to do a little test, see what you guys think of this setup. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Do you think this is kind of cool? We can uh, put different kind of products up here and uh, go from there. Let's do one more. Let's do one more. I've got this crazy looking little, uh, looks like it's time to go. I'm getting a light flash here. So we're headed out. Thanks for tuning in. I will edit this out and I will be back in the next clip. Thanks for tuning in. Todd, Nostalgia Picker.